Our next speaker is Stacy Mitchell. Stacy. Thank you, Shere Khan and commissioners. Uh, I'm Stacy Mitchell, the co-executive director of the Institute for Local Self-Reliance, a research and policy organization. Today, I wanna draw your attention to the steep and growing fees that Amazon imposes on businesses that rely on its site to reach the online market. In 2014, third-party sellers paid Amazon $19 in fees for every $100 in sales they made. Today, that's up to $34. This month, my organization released a report called Amazon's Toll Road that breaks down these fees and analyzes their growth over time. We found that the base price of selling on Amazon has risen sharply and that the services that Amazon presents to sellers as optional are, in, in fact, effectively mandatory. Because Amazon dominates online product search, sellers have no viable alternative for reaching the market. As such, Amazon can keep hiking its fees. This year, Amazon will generate over $120 billion in seller fees. That's twice what it took in just two years ago. We found that seller fees generate massive profits for Amazon, which is a fact that its financial reports do not disclose. In effect, seller fees are how Amazon monetizes its monopoly power. And as we detail in the report, Amazon also relies on profits from seller fees to fund several strategies, uh, including sustained below cost pricing that are designed to entrench its dominance and thwart competition. Needless to say, these steep and growing fees impose a debilitating burden on businesses, curtailing their ability to invest, innovate, create jobs, and in many cases, driving them to bankruptcy. So I hope this is something that the commission will examine as part of your enforcement and rulemaking responsibilities. Thank you.